do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello friends now we are going to talk about a new concept that is isotope which is related to atomic number and atomic mass number that we have did earlier also so let us see in a very deep detail now talking about isotope isotope means as we know that all the atoms of an element have same number of electron as less the number of proton this is because the electrons are negative charge and the protons are of positive charge so maintain to maintain a electrical neutrality so because of the when the number of electrons and the number of protons when both will be the same then the electron will be uh, then the atom will be electronically neutral so as to uh, compromise the charges and but the neutron which is having no charge can be of more quantity or can be of less quantity so that is what they have said that but may have same or different number of neutrons means basically an atom can have same or different number of neutrons compared to that of electron or compared to that of proton so such type of atoms are basically known as isotopes let me give an short idea that how could you uh, estimate that whether a atom is an isotope or not for that i have given you an example in this case the carbon which has an atomic number of 6 while the atomic mass number of that is 12 while that of the another uh, element which is nothing but the carbon itself has atomic number of 6 while that of the atomic number atomic mass number which is nothing but 13 so there is a difference between the number of neutrons how let me give you a short example suppose for carbon 6 12 this is the thing that i have mentioned here in this thing the number which is given below is nothing but the atomic number and we denote the atomic number by x and in this case atomic number means the total number of electrons or total number of protons that are been present so i could clearly indicate that np that is number of proton and ne that is number of electron would be the same that is 6 while this one this number that is 12 which is uh, given above the um, the atomic symbol of carbon which is nothing but the atomic mass number and atomic mass number it is usually represented by that is a So atomic mass number is a. So how can we represent this thing? So it is nothing but the number of proton plus number of that is neutron. So in this case, suppose if I say that the atomic mass number, which is nothing but twelve, and number of proton in this case that we have got it as six. So therefore, the number of neutron in this case will be twelve minus six, nothing but six itself. But when I talk about an isotope. of carbon which is nothing but this one in this case the number of uh, proton and the number of electron that is the atomic number which is given here will be the same as it is that is np is equals to 6 while that of the atomic mass number that is suppose if i say it as a that is suppose if a is atomic mass number which is nothing but np plus nn in this case nn means nothing but number of neutron so the atomic mass number is nothing but in this case is given as 13 while that of np is 6 and in this case the total number of neutron will be 13 minus 6 that is 7 and in this case as we could see that the number of electrons and the number of protons for both the cases are same but the number of neutrons uh, for the carbon for this isotope and this isotope the both are different so therefore they are said to be isotopes so it has been very clearly mentioned so therefore in nature also few elements or more elements have such kind of isotopes and hence it is very much necessary for us to know that which isotope should be considered in the uh, calculation of a particular chemical reaction or for a stoichiometry or in any cases so for that only we have derive or we have got a new term that is known as abundance which is this one so among the all the elements that are present or the all the isotopes that are present for an element so we are considering only those element which are present in abundance or the of which the quantity is being more 
so for that we have the percentage of different isotopes is known as abundance so let me give an example of neon itself suppose neon has three isotopes like which has atomic mass of 19 uh, u that is unified mass that is for neon 20 the abundance which is formed for in nature is nothing but 90.92 percentage while that of the neon which has a atomic number of 22 or atomic mass number of 22 has an ato uh, abundance of 8.82 percentage while that of the neon 21 which has an abundance of 0.26 percentage so this kind of isotopes that are being present in uh, the um, nature and among which we have to calculate uh, and we could easily calculate that uh, among that why neon 20 has 90.2 percentage of abundance there is a very small calculation that we could do which is nothing but this one that it is very easy to calculate the abundance that is for an element which has different isotopes with the different atomic mass uh, masses so for that the calculation of the abundance is very much easy how the abundance of an isotope is nothing but the number of atoms of a given atomic mass suppose if i am talking about the neon 20 which is present in the nature but there are also more number of atoms of neon that is isotopes when i am talking about isotopes that is neon 20 neon 21 and neon 22 so that would be the total number of atoms and among which i am comparing a particular one that is might be neon 21 might be neon 20 or might be neon 22 so among that i will take here i will divide by the total number of atoms and i will multiply by 100 so by this thing i could get that which kind of uh, isotope is being present in more quantity or less quantity or what is the quantity of that particular element in the nature and that is nothing but known as abundance so this is what we have talked about isotope so i hope you have understood this thing and uh, you have liked this thing and you will try to uh, focus more in understanding what is isotopes so share this video with the friends and yes don't forget to subscribe eGida channel thank you so much